Hey guys, how's it going? Um, I am popping on here to do a really quick video um, because Freya is waking up from her nap <laughs> and I'm going to have to go get her right away. But I wanted to make a change in our budget and I thought, why not film it? You know, it's, <laughs> it's nothing big, but I just I wanted to share it with you guys. So um, if you saw our last few budgeting with us videos, we're doing the 100 envelope challenge. And so the idea is that every week we would fill two envelopes at random. And so I've just kind of been going through picking them at random. And as you can see, we have money in a few of them. But it's becoming a little cumbersome to scroll through. And I also didn't really want to leave the money sitting in our bank account because it's not money that I want to touch. It's money that we want to be saving. So... I think our plan right now is to actually move this into our investment account where we can earn um, a higher rate of return on it. And then at the end of the year, we can decide what we want to do with it. We m we'll probably just decide to leave it in there. Um, but I mean, we might decide to put it on debt or something as well. Who knows? So I'm going to show you how I'm going to do this. So I'm going to go into the fund me first and I'm going to go to invest investing. We'll say, sure, we'll call it that for now. I'll put it there and I wonder can I just I don't know if I can move all of these or if I would have to delete them I think I might try YNAB's new feature where if you delete something you can recategorize it reset available amounts to zero yeah but then I would have to delete all of them and remember which ones <sighs> How do we do this? I wish there was a way to like mass delete categories, but there's not, is there? Okay, maybe this isn't going to work the way I wanted it to. I will just have to go through <laughs> and delete them one by one, I guess. If there is a better way to do this and I'm just not <laughs> thinking of it, would you guys let me know? <laughs> if you guys can hear Freya, I apologize. She's currently transitioning from a one nap a day, or sorry, from two naps a day to one nap a day. So it's been a bit of a struggle around here. But she did good today. She napped for almost an hour and a half, which is pretty good for her. It's actually really good for her. All right, so now that I have all of that taken out, I can just go ahead and move it to investing. And then I can add a transaction to Took me a minute there. <laughs> Investing of $884. And I'll do that actual transfer once I'm done this video here. And then it should come out of our budget. Yeah. And it would come down to our invest account down here. But I think that's what makes sense because we will earn a much better rate of return in here. Like we usually average between 8 and 10% back so I would rather do that <laughs> I would rather be making money on that money because I know it's money that we're not going to be touching and we don't need immediate access to unlike you know like our emergency fund we would need access to that right away if there was an emergency um, so yeah that's it it was a quick video uh, thank you guys for watching and I will see you later this week when we get Cody's next paycheck and we can start budgeting into May bye